guys. Today, I have an ear infection, so I can't get my ear underwater or get water in my ear. First of all, it hurts, and second of all, it takes a lot longer for it to get better. So, in order to not get water in my ear, I am going to put my cap over my ears. Some people like to put in earplugs, but I don't like that because I can't hear anything. But some people like earplugs, and we'll show you some earplugs later that you might want to try. But let me show you a few things that you can do if you have an ear infection. The number one thing is go to the doctor. The number two thing, if you still want to swim, is get a good silicone cap and make sure you cover your ears so that no water gets in. But you might not be able to hear yourself, but everybody else will be able to hear you. <laughs> the third thing is you can still kick. The fourth thing is you can do a one-arm drill with the kickboard but keep your head above the water. Remember to put the cap over your ears. Remember in this drill to rotate. You don't want to do that drill really flat because it defeats the purpose. Okay, let's watch it again and see how my body's rotating. This is kind of a hard drill, so sorry I'm a little out of breath. Try to keep the board under the water so that you don't pinch your shoulder. The fifth thing you can do is aqua jogging. I like to do it without a belt, but you might want to try to put on one of the aqua jogger belts. We'll show you that later. But in a shallow pool, you can do it on the bottom. But if you have deeper water, which is preferable, you can do it without the bottom. Like so. This is kind of boring, so you might want to get a waterproof iPod so you can listen to some music. Or check out the scene on the pool deck. <laughs> Have fun, remember go to the doctor, and I hope you feel better soon.